CT here. Welcome. We are on episode 12, which I am hoping is the final episode. Because this game has clearly run its course a long time ago. So I am definitely waiting for that end. Let's continue. The final queen. Yes, Queen Dido. She's been resting on the ocean floor since that day. Which means we'll find her. A Terra Grigia. Exactly. We have a responsibility to see this mission through. O'Brien out. So if it already sank, what are we hoping to find? FBC, everybody freeze! All of you, put your heads in the air! understand how they would have that kind of authority. I, I just, I do not understand FBC Morgan and BSAA left. laws and things. We're taking this show over. The BSAA is hereby under the direct supervision of the FBC. Clive R. O'Brien, you are under arrest for collaborating with the terrorist organization Veltro. It does look like that, doesn't it? Well, then we'll be fine. It's Chris Redfield and Jill there Valentine. They're the best the team you could get. And the Look no further than Resident Evil 1. Approaching drop off point. <laughs> don't look at that Resident Evil 5 episode that will be in the future. Oh boy, no. <laughs> they don't make such a good team at the end there. <laughs> oh. Oh, sure, now she gets a suit after all that underwater swimming. Ugh. That's the Queen Dido. The third queen. Our guns are gonna work underwater? Really? Oh my gosh. <laughs> It's rather quiet, like time itself has stopped. The blobs we found on the beach, they came from here. That explains why Morgan cordoned off the area. See, the whole ocean seems infected already. How fast do people rot? Shouldn't he be more rotted than this after a year? I 
mean, he looks fine. Well, you know, not fine. I wonder if those corpses on the beach were Veltro. <laughs> Go through the door. Something's still alive. Careful. You won't be able to fight them off underwater. Why not? I've done it before when I was holding my breath somehow. This music is terrible. It doesn't fit the situation at all. I was trying to it's an electric lock. I hope the emergency power still works. Oh, maybe we're supposed to go through the are all pulled apart. I'll fix them. Oh, Marcus. Okay, yeah. I'll see if I can get the power going. Oh, so I'm gonna do it. <laughs> okay, we're both kind of doing it. I was afraid of that. Yep, and more insta kill crap. Don't put this in your games without good reason. Oh, come on, I didn't even see him.
doesn't kill it. Are you kidding me? I don't really understand where I'm going with that. I thought I had to get that way. Yeah, I got that, thanks. So, what am I missing? supposed to go. So dumb. Open. Okay, on my way back. <sighs> How many times do you think I'll die trying to get back? See, that happens all the time. You can't see. Jill, the door's open. Okay, on my way back. to that it's really hard to maneuver her and oh my gosh you have a recipe for I'm going to kill everybody Ugh, again the same spot I threw the grenade and it didn't do anything Ugh, how useless Jill the door's open okay on my way back Close. Oh, 
kidding. I've only died like five times. I'm so good at it. Okay, let's move in. There's still air. Who's that? Is that a thing for submerged ships? You can have air if you've been underwater it for like a year? What? There are people that have just been alive? See, I didn't think the guy in the water had been dead for long. He's FBC. Yeah, thanks, Chris. I can There's read our man. At least I'm with you, Chris. This is Agent Dario Barioni of the FBC Armed Forces. The time is 1948. I request that this recorder be handed over to General Lansdale. If found by the next team, everyone on my team is dead. Killed by the devil himself. We were unable to retrieve the video log. Our mission has failed. Veltro, they weren't sitting around waiting for death to come to them. When the FBC arrived, they were waiting for us. Even though Terra Grigio was a year ago. Yeah, somehow they're down here alive. Ridiculous. But then so is using completely submerged weapons, so obviously this game does not care about logic of any kind. <laughs> yeah, the obvious yellow light apparently means you can find stuff. Gosh. I am so slow. Took me forever to realize that's what that was. Like, I think I vaguely knew, but frustrations were just overwhelmed me anyway. Haunted? What? <laughs> we are in an actual haunted house right now, people. Ooh. I feel bad for you, except you guys have totally had this coming. 
This is exactly the kind of fate you all deserve. Dante Alighieri's La Divina Commedia, an offering to the dead, the divine comedy. A passage has been underlined. How old the rain maketh them like unto dogs. One side they make a shelter for the other. Oft turn themselves the wretched reprobates. Dante Alighieri's La Divina Commedia Inferno Canto <laughs> um, V1. I don't know what number that is. Six? I could be wrong. There is something written at the edge of the page in sloppy handwriting. Those who offer their lives to the doctrine forever walk the path with the great Jack Norman. You say that like that's something I want. I don't want that. I don't like Norman, okay? Ooh. Well, I mean, they seem to like their buddies. That's like a ooh, but the wouldn't logic dictate he just turns into a, any old monster? You know, just be mindless like all the rest. How come he gets to be special just because? There's no scientific explanation. is mad at another terrorist for betraying him. Part of me if my eyes are dry. All of our interactions are right in here. We shall become guardians of the truth for as many years as it may take. Jack Norman was the head of Veltro. He has the video we can use to nail Lansdale. Oh, come on. It such an obvious print. I was like, make it a print. was ridiculously well cut. Who doth read that which was manifest like, come on, there's no way this place was underwater for a year. That's insane. There's no way that could happen, Pate right? Satan, Pate Satan, Alepe. You're not clever just because you can quote the Divine Comedy dude. Especially when it makes no sense to your present situation. Oh, 
<laughs> oh yeah, look at this boss fight. Oh, I didn't even notice him up there. Morgan! Morgan Lansdale! How dare you cross Feltro! Are you in pain? Good. Oh, come on. Morgan, Why would you put this in here? This is what you seek, is it not? You haven't turned yet? When did you inject yourself? Indeed. Did this just this happen? Oh, that's the right. Truth. They mentioned that like the they'd been alive a year. So you survived only to get taken out by some like FBC dudes or something? Is that what I'm understanding? Quick, the evidence, Chris. Um, I guess. Hmm, <sighs> depends. Like, if he's a. It depends what kind of enemy he is. I guess for now, I'll swap out the Magnum and maybe during the fight they'll let me keep doing that. Or maybe they won't, but we'll find out. I guess we'll try this one first. And maybe it'll let me keep switching guns? Maybe not. But we'll find out. Here we go! Yoink! This is it! We got the evidence! Let's go! Oh, I thought we were supposed to wait around. Come on, he's totally gonna block the exit, right? This is clearly an arena. Yeah. Morgan, behold the terror which you have unleashed. He can't see you, dude. I thought drinking it didn't work. I remember reading a note about that kind of thing. He just dies. He just killed him. That was it. Okay, we are going to stop here for the day. Thank you for watching. Sorry that once again this is not the final video. Maybe the next one. I feel like I'm a broken record at this point. But so is this game. Please like and subscribe. Comment below if you would like to. Bye.